your WhatsApp, your own spec, guys. Assalamualaikum guys, Fia Andre is back Alright, Assalamualaikum dan salam jahatan kepada korang yang menonton channel Andre Brothers Korang memang awesome guys Yes, we are back dengan kita punya video-video react Apa khabar korang? Adakah korang dalam keadaan sihat? Kalau sihat, Alhamdulillah syukur kepada Allah atas nikmat kesihatan yang Allah berikan kepada kita Dan apabila korang nampak je muka aku, yes, tak lain tak bukan, aku akan buat video react ha, Kalau korang nampak muka Mikael, of course dia akan buat video makanan lah guys dan seperti biasa, aku tahu ada antara korang yang dah tak sabar yang menanti-nanti video react uh, daripada uh, Andre Brothers. Dan seperti video-video yang lepas-lepas pun, aku banyak react video daripada Noob Stock 5. Mesti korang pernah tertanya-tanya kenapa eh? Uh, of course, jawapan ni aku akan katakan video-video uh, daripada Noob Stock 5 adalah video-video yang terbaik lah. Kira uh, favorite channel aku lah. Sebab dia punya... Teknik penceritaan dia, dia punya muzik, uh, segala-galanya yang dilakukan oleh Noob Stock 5 ni memang memang cantik guys. Memang ngam sangat lah. Uh, kalau aku tengok, dia punya seram dan takut tu sampai guys. Uh, aku rasa tanpa kita melengahkan banyak masa, lebih baik kita straight forward dengan kita punya video react. Nanti aku cakap banyak, nanti dia akan lagi buang masa kan. So guys, are you ready? Good. Jom. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Ada bunyi ketukkan guys. Dia start main ketuk-ketuk guys. Katanya kat katanya kat hotel ni dia dihantui oleh hantu budak bernama Emma guys. Dan katanya si Emma ni mati dibunuh oleh seorang lelaki yang uh, lelaki jahat lah guys eh. Ui, ganas juga tempat ni. That's a gun. No, it's not. Yes, it is. They hear the unexplained sounds of knocking and possible gunfire while exploring the hotel rooms. However, it's what they didn't hear at the time that is absolutely chilling. I sit down for a second too before we go to the unfinished part. Get on the lights. Guys, I know. I know it's kind of The voice of what sounds like a young girl can be heard saying the eerie word, Mommy. Now, if that wasn't creepy enough, the owners of the Magnolia Hotel actually caught what they believe to be the same young girl, little Emma, on one of their static cameras. The camera is set up in the room where the ghost of Emma has reportedly been seen and heard the most. They call it the quote, children's room. One day they leave a bunch of balls and toys for Emma to play with. And then this happens. Oh, 
Gerak guys Tak tahu apa bola itu Ui Uuuh. Boleh nampak macam shadow guys Balls on the floor mysteriously seem to just start rolling around on their own But what's most bizarre about this footage is the strange shadow figure that follows right after the unexplained movement Could it be that the spirit of little Emma is playing with the toys? Is the Magnolia Hotel haunted by the ghosts of the people who lost their lives inside its walls? Let me know what you think down in the comments. You can watch Colin and Peyton's entire investigation over on the YouTube channel, The Paranormal Files. And you can find more spooky evidence and photos over on the Magnolia Hotel's Facebook page. Viewer Videos in this next segment, I'm very happy to feature some extremely creepy videos that were sent to me directly via email by Nukes Top 5 viewers. First up, this video was sent in by Dex, who claims that one of his friends has been going on apartment viewings in the hopes of finding a new place to live. His friend recorded one of the empty apartments so he could look back at the footage later to help him decide. When he reviews his footage, he is shocked by what he finds. Nampak macam While recording, Dex's friend thinks he sees something out of the corner of his eye A dark shadow-like figure standing at the end of the hallway But when he pans back, nothing there So did Dex's Ooh, friend guy. capture a ghost on camera? Yeah, Could it be that the aku. apartment is empty for a reason? I leave it up to you to decide This next video was emailed to me by Connor from Corpus Christi, Texas in his email, he explains that his cousin is awakened in the middle of the night when a stranger suddenly approaches his ring doorbell. The doorbell camera records as things take a very creepy turn. Ni kenapa mamat ni? Mambuk ke apa? Orang tu betul ke tak betul eh? Nampak macam dia mabuk pun ada. Tak tahu apa reason dia pergi. Ni rumah dia ke? Rumah orang ke apa? Kita tak tahu. The man who rang the doorbell is odd and erratic as he pleads for them to open the door and let him inside. Understandably, they don't answer the door. And the man eventually walks away defeated, loudly yelling, I'm not dead. Connor's cousin has no idea what happened to the man, and the scary event remains a mystery. But I'd guess some chemical substances were probably involved. If you see a video that you think would be perfect for the top five, or if you have a ghost hunting channel and you caught something great, contact me at nukestop5 at gmail.com. Visits. Okay guys, ada tiga video yang kita tengok tadi. Yang pertama tu, uh, video yang pertama sekali tu, pasal Hotel Magnolia. Eh. Dan... Hotel tu di, diganggu oleh uh, hantu budak kecil yang bernama Emma. Dikatakan Emma ni mati uh, sebab dibunuh oleh seorang lelaki yang tak tahulah lelaki ni psikopat ke apa. Tapi dia mati dibunuh dengan menggunakan kapak guys. 
Dan akhirnya laki tu pun mati juga Dan hotel ni dihantui oleh Dia orang berdua lah Tapi yang yang banyak menjemen adalah hantu budak kecil katanya Yang, yang bernama Emma ni Dan kalau kita tengok footage tadi tu Agak seram juga pasal Memang aku rasa uh, owner hotel ni Dia tahu kekuatan hotel ni Untuk menarik uh, pengunjung datang adalah Dengan bagi tahu hotel ni memang berhantu Jadi ada pengunjung yang memang suka nak adventure benda-benda hantu macam tu Jadi dia orang pergilah dan kalau kau tengok footage tu Dia memang ada satu bilik ni Sengaja dia letakkan bilik mainan budak-budak tau Ternyata mainan ni Dia main oleh Emma guys Kita boleh nampak tadi Bola tu bergerak Dan ada semacam Lembaga hitam kejap tu kan uh, Itu apa yang dikatakan oleh owner lah Tapi kalau menurut kepercayaan uh, Akulah Sebenarnya Orang yang dah mati ni um, Aku tak sure dia boleh kembali balik ke alam ni tapi yang menyerupai benda-benda ni aku lebih meyakini benda tu adalah jin lah ha. yang nombor dua video di mana dia orang nak percaya rumah sewa lah ha, rumah sewa so dia record dulu so agak mengejutkan apabila dia record tu dia nampak ada satu lembaga hitam dia tu scary guys memang aku pun pernah terkena dulu nak cari rumah untuk uh, lepas aku jual rumah aku nak cari rumah lah untuk beli rumah so aku pergi ke satu kondo ni kondo ni cantik gila guys dia kondo lama lah Uh, di Bukit Terbangsa uh, Ternyata kondo ni Kawasan dia tu memang haunted lah. Memang bila aku pergi kat situ je Isteri aku tak pernah-pernah uh, Alhamdulillah Dalam hidup dia tak pernah kena rasuk Tapi kat situ dia hampir-hampir kena rasuk Dan memang uh, Aku dah tahulah bila isteri aku ni Orang yang semangat dia kuat pun boleh Boleh nak kena rasuk waktu siang Aku syak rumah tu kosong bersebab uh, Sebab tu uh, aku tak jadi nak beli rumah tu lah Dan sama juga kes yang berlaku kepada yang video kita tengok tu Ada nampak kelibat warna hitam kat situ So kita tak tahu mungkin sebabkan itulah rumah tu kosong guys Dan video ketiga ni pelik sikit lah uh, Aku rasa mamat yang tadi tu kalau tak mabuk dadah lah Sebab nampak pun macam tak betul lah Dia boleh cakap aku tak mati lagi Aku tak mati lagi pergi uh, apa ni tekan loceng tak, rumah orang kot Dan ada tiga video kat sini aku rasa video kali ni biasa je kita go next video okey to the funeral home chinese ghost hunter and popular live streamer xiao long is back with another scary adventure at a creepy abandoned funeral home in xinjiang city china local legend says that restless souls unable to move on after their deaths have found themselves trapped inside the funeral home eternally doomed to haunt the lonely abandoned building forever locals say the home is cursed But as always, none of that stops our boy Xiao Long. He travels to the abandoned funeral home completely alone. Ooh, the as he's exploring outside the building, he stumbles upon an old abandoned hearse that was once used to transport bodies. What happens next is truly bizarre. Dia pergi seorang ke dengan kawan dia? Ooh, <laughs> terbuka asli guys. Ini macam uh, When the, oh, dia main tutup guys Ini ni macam Van jenazah tu guys Shalong fans love the creepy live stream And demand that he return to the haunted funeral home For yet another visit As always, he broadcasts his investigation live as he explores a different area of the building. As you might suspect, it did not go well. So, kali ni dia pergi seorang, guys. Selalu dia berdua dengan kawan dia, kan? Ayuh, saya tahu ni, ma. 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 Oh, dia dah buka guys oh, Ya Allah aku tu dia, ish, Ya Allah Ini macam ruangan Jenazah kan Xiaolong is horrified when he discovers that the area was actually used to store human bodies. Even though he's starting to freak out a bit, he returns to the crematorium carrying what he says is a protective amulet. He finds an old oven, and that's when he sees something absolutely horrifying. Dia bawa tangkai, tangkai. Oh, <laughs> 
Apa dia nampak guys? Apa dia nampak guys? Mamat ni punya video memang scary scary guys dan dia dia live streaming tu guys dia bukan shoot ni dia memang buat live experiencing terrifying paranormal activity in his home after he played around with a Ouija board at a friend's house he says that he believes that he might have accidentally summoned a demonic entity that followed him home in an attempt to record himself and explain what's been going on he's interrupted by something very creepy so I've had a lot of weird stuff thing happening lately and I I can't Kita kat hello guys. Ada benda ikut balik ni guys. Hello. A child's voice can be heard. Yet Michael claims he has no children. He says he doesn't know where the mysterious voice could have possibly come from. So Michael decides to set up static cameras all around his home in the hopes of capturing more proof of the paranormal activity that has been terrorizing him. When he looks back at the footage from his kitchen camera, he's shocked. <laughs> eh, itu cat dia kan? Cat dia main benda tu kan? Tak ni aku rasa biasa je pasal cat dia main benda tu rasanya. Uh, ke benda ni lompat sendiri guys? Michael and his girlfriend Heather decide to do another Ouija board session. This time to try to get answers as to what is going on. But things take a terrifying turn. H. Hmm, main Ouija board memang lah. Kau menyeru benda tu. E. L. R. R. Q. Hmm. Here. Good friend, dia takut guys. Good friend, dia takut. Oh yo. Ada benda kat atas ni guys. Ada macam benda berlari kan? Ya? Finally crashes to the ground right next to Heather and then they both hear a loud sound coming from upstairs. When they look up the staircase, someone or something that they can't see comes charging down the stairs at them. So is Michael's house haunted by a demonic entity? Drop your thoughts down in the comments. TikTok user Roche Bananas is working the night shift as a security guard on a reservation in Saskatchewan, Canada when she and her co-worker see something very strange. When we work night security 8 p.m. to 8 a.m. and we see something coming at us at midnight. Oh, what's that? What's that? Raylan! What's that? What's that? TikTok user Roche Bananas claims she has no idea what she recorded that night and is pretty spooked by the creepy encounter. Many concerned TikTok viewers believe that it could be anything from a skinwalker. Serious, no, 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 to a ghost but what do you think it is macam camouflage ya or is it all tak, macam askar pakai baju yang daun-daun tu kan the eternal bride all of the residents of Culiacan in Sinaloa Mexico know of the story of Lupita the eternal bride the story goes that back in the early 1950s a young woman named Lupita was engaged to be married to her childhood sweetheart Jesus the bride to be and her fiance were both friends with a man named Ernesto, who was hopelessly in love with Lupita. But Lupita had no romantic interest at all in Ernesto. Ernesto was driven mad by his jealousy, and on the wedding day, he took the life of Lupita's husband to be as she watched on in horror. Ernesto then took his own life. 
bunuh diri. Lupita was so traumatized by the event that she never recovered and just completely lost touch with reality. Every Sunday for the next 30 years, Lupita would dress in her wedding gown and walk to the church cathedral in town. After her death in 1982, she was buried, and it is said that she aimlessly roams the cemetery grounds, still in her wedding dress to this day. A paranormal investigator from Mexico who happens to share the name Ernesto from the YouTube channel Zona Paranormal Veracruz is joined by his friends and fellow investigators El Payaso de la Toledo and Lorena Jacobo. Together they explore the cemetery late at night. They hear strange unexplained sounds all around them. And then this happens. Hey. Muéstrate, Lupita. Te pido que te muestres. Ya te vi. Ya jalaste energía. Es cierto, yo me llamo René. No, 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 no. La madre, payaso, 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 payaso. Ahí, güey. Ahí, ahí, ahí se asomó. Yo me llamo Ernesto. Como el, 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 que, el que asesinó a tu esposo. Así se llamaba el que asesinó a tu esposo. ¿Estás enojada porque me llamo como él? No quepo ahí. A ver, voy a ver, voy a ver. Sí, que puta lo iba. De lado, por favor. A ver. A ver. Ay, ay, payaso. Espérame, 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 espérame. El bote. Espérame, 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 espérame. Espérame, ay, güey. Ay, en esa cabeza, güey. Se está muy bien, güey. Nada más sonido. Oh, this is what we're doing, guys. Ernesto is broadcasting live on Facebook when he spots someone appear and disappear near one of the graves. Oh, they hurry over to investigate, but Ernesto gets stuck in between two tombs. In a shocking turn, Ernesto feels someone or something pulling him back. And then, did you see it? Right behind Payaso, another mysterious apparition can be seen lurking behind the tomb. Now this again, this is a live stream broadcast. The figure is spotted by the viewing audience, but the two investigators are completely unaware of what they've just captured. This scary, guys. We want to find the exploration. Payaso caminó aquí enfrente, güey. Caminó aquí enfrente, güey. Caminó aquí enfrente, cabrón. La, la agarré, la agarré, la agarré, la agarré, la agarré, la agarré, la agarré. La agarré, la agarré, la agarré, la agarré. La agarré, la agarré, la agarré. La agarré, güey, la agarré, la agarré. Ay, 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 ay. La rodilla, la rodilla, güey. La rodilla, la rodilla. Lore. Vamos a ver a Lore, güey. Vamos a buscar a Lore. Va, vamos, vamos a buscarla. Lore. Sigue mandando saludos. Sí, eh, está mandando, está en vivo todavía. Ahí está Lorena y está en vivo, señores. Mm. Lo, lo que vimos, vimos a la novia. Yo no sumo en la live stream. Ya agarramos. Ey, pero yo también estoy bien y la gente también eh, eh, eh. es que es que dicen que que me puede seguir porque yo me llamo como el que mató a su esposo. Me jalaron la mochila, había un lugar donde no, donde no cabía y me jalaron la mochila. A ver, les voy a enfocar para que vean que Lore sigue en línea. Aquí estoy. Yo, a ver, miren. Aquí estoy. Lore. See in vivo. The guys see an apparition that appears to be wearing a long white dress. They quickly go to find fellow investigator Lorena, who's broadcasting her own live stream in a different area of the cemetery. She explains that she too saw the figure of what appeared to be Lupita, the lonely bride. Now, as I mentioned, this stream was live, so it would be yeah. very hard to fake. Me live but, though, guys. What do you think? Can I like me man to start now, guys? Down below. You can check out more of Ernesto's creepy live streams Kalau over on his YouTube channel. Ini, agak don't look at your mind, what life? Thanks for watching. Follow me on Instagram here, Twitter here, or hey, look at that. It's a TikTok. Eh. Anyway, hopefully I'll see you next week.
Okay guys, itu dia video daripada Noob Top 5. Mana yang belum follow atau subscribe Noob Top 5, kau pergi follow dia, pergi subscribe dia. Mana yang belum layan lagi, layan video-video dia. Tapi mana yang nak tunggu, nak layan dengan aku, Alhamdulillah syukur. Okay guys, uh, ada beberapa video yang last kita tengok tadi tu. Yang pertama yang Shai Long tu eh, yang daripada China tu. Shai Long punya video ni memang tak pernah mengecewakan. Kita tahu dia punya video memang kebanyakan dia memang seram lah. Uh, kadang-kadang dia pergi kawan dia tau berdua tau dan kita tahu uh, Shai Long ni dia memang suka menjerit-menjerit yang pada pendapat aku lah Shai Long punya video tadi memang memang seram lah kalau compare yang lain-lain tadi tu pasal apa kita boleh nampak uh, mula-mula kita nampak macam ran, keran, ran jenazah eh. nampak dia main pintu belakang kan? itu yang pertama lepas tu yang kedua tu uh, tempat simpan mayat tu guys boleh terbuka dan benda tu tercampak ke lah tu sumpah scary ya. dan yang paling menakutkan yang last tu lah yang kita nampak aku mula tak nampak sangat tau tapi bila nampak macam kepala putih tu naik atas silang oh, tu meremang bulu mama guys kita yang pertama Shai Long lah lepas tu ada beberapa lagi yang uh, yang itu aku tak tahu hantu ke tak yang perempuan yang macam kerja malam tu kan yang kita nampak ada dia rekod penampakan orang bergerak tapi orang tu macam Uh, badan ni macam berumput tau dia macam pakai baju camouflage ni tau macam biasanya askar-askar akan pakai baju yang macam daun lah. lebih kurang macam tu lah so aku tak tahu adakah itu orang ke dia orang buat ke atau ada orang saja nak takutkan dia aku tak sure lah uh, cuma yang last tadi tu agak menakutkan juga yang pasal yang go santa daripada Mexico ni kan dia pergi ke kubur ni uh, mana dekat kubur ni katanya famous dengan hantu yang perempuan pakai gaun lah uh, sebabkan perempuan ni dia kecewa Uh, atas kematian laki dia dan dia tak boleh terima hakikat sampailah dia mati hantu dia pun mulalah menjelma kat situlah katanya dan dia orang record kat situ itu bukan record tau dia live streaming kalau recording ni orang senang sikit nak buat fake nak buat hantu ke apa ke tapi kalau live streaming memang susah guys nak buat dan kalau kita tengok video yang dia dapat capture tu memang kebanyakan dia menyeramkan especially yang kalau kau perasan tu belakang kawan dia nampak aja satu image oh scary guys aku tak tahu nak cakap macam mana lah So aku tak tahu apa pendapat korang untuk video kali ni kalau pada aku untuk yang second half ni banyak yang menakutkan especially yang Shailong dengan yang hantu yang kat Mexico tu lah. So guys, uh, aku sangat-sangat berharap agar video kali ni uh, korang terhibur seperti mana aku terhibur. Malam kalau nak tidur jangan lupa baca doa guys. Yang mana dah follow daripada awal sampai habis aku ucapkan jutaan terima kasih guys. Aku doakan supaya korang panjang umur, murah rezeki dan dipermudahkan segala urusan dunia dan akhirat guys. So sehingga kita berjumpa untuk kita punya next video. Korang jaga diri baik-baik. Stay safe, stay cool. Guys, korang memang awesome. Ciao.